What's up, YouTube? Robert the Corny Drap here, and I am back again with another episode of Rob's Random ROMs. This is where I take Google's random number generator, set it to the number of NES ROMs that I have, which is 547, and then I play that game. Today's game is actually an unlicensed port again. But this time, it's not going to be Pikachu creeping up in our in our video, it's actually Donkey Kong Country. Um, this game was actually originally published for the NES back in 93, and the port that they made for the NES was accomplished in 1997. But it's Donkey Kong Country. I mean, how much could you really argue with it, right? Don't need any further ado. Let's pop up the game here. As you can see, 1997. Oh, and they also have the Jungle Book too. But we're we're, we're gonna stick with Donkey Kong Country. I'd had my volume up for because uh, I don't like to keep my headphones on me, and I don't always have a speaker because I don't have any speakers on this thing. Just straight drop kick your old man, huh? That's not nice. And then nuke your nuke him. Hmm. You know, I've I've played I think I remember playing rather the original uh Donkey Kong on NES and not only I mean while the graphics were obviously going to be better. Hmm. I'm also noticing some artifacting there, so we're going to try and fix this. Oh! That was an interesting way to do that. I gotta really give ups to the, uh... To the guys who programmed this to, to, to go in that direction. To think to do that that way. 25? Big Kong, instead of playing Diddy Kong, and you can and you can switch. Good. Apparently, those guys have colliders on them that they know not to go that far. Um, let's see what else interesting. I mean, I like the uh, I like how they've faithfully recreated the uh, kind of the aesthetic of the whole thing while not uh, sacrificing uh, I'm sorry while cutting corners to get to get it to fit on the uh, the engine KON Got the Kong. Got the exit. And the gameplay is not changing. Oh goodness me. <laughs> what what fresh hell is this? Uh, 
I don't know what's going on nor why why it's happening. But uh, how do you even fight these guys? It's not. I, I don't even think you can. I don't think there's a way to. I mean, I think that in the original there probably was, you know, like they had to they had to have installed something back in the day so that way in the underwater area you could fight. You could defend yourself like it wasn't a complete just you got to Although I will say that some of the pitch for some of the the things in this level are are terrible. I'll play as Diddy Kong because it seems to be working better for me. But uh no, I mean the pitch is a little off and it's it's slightly dis uh dis slightly concerning. And number 2, monkeys while they do swim, they probably don't swim this well. Hmm, that urchin seems like it's going to be a problem, so I should stop doing that, probably. I think for me, the thing that also gets me is the fact that the pause menu doesn't do anything. Um, just blanks out the screen. Normally not a terrible thing, but... Let's switch to Diddy here. What can I say? I like the kid. He's got, he's got some skills. Um, let's see what else. Um, the, the animations are interesting. The, the way that they've, uh, worked the 8-bit sprite to, to ape very much what, uh, they did for the, uh, for the NES. I mean, it's it's a good-looking rendering, as far as those things go. Um, I don't particularly care for the fact that all of the uh, bananas are not uh, yellow. Oh, that's a big shark. And I haven't found another barrel. I'd like to find another barrel. Oh, nope, 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 Yeah, let's, let's see if we can go to, to game over, I guess. If there happens to be one. I don't think that there is, because I've died a couple times and it still says 25 on the balloons, so I'm guessing that the way that this guy set it up is that he set it up to a no-fail state. Which is not terrible. It's just... Uh, slightly annoying. Not because you don't... you don't ever want to not fail. Because failing in video games uh, is not fun. But, you know, you, you, you get what you get. And... For for me, I get a, I get a lot of of enjoyment. Yeah. Okay. So it did go down. It finally did go down. But you know, um, it's not like it's a it was a bad game necessarily. It's just there's. I mean, I feel like everybody kind of already knows. Uh, what to expect out of Donkey Kong games, especially Donkey Kong con uh, Country games, wherein you're going to get decent uh, gameplay and interesting visuals. Um, obviously, the NES version, if I could record those, I would, and I will ever work on that, you know, because... Um, 
I haven't figured out how to make OBS, I'm sorry, uh, XSplit record that gameplay. The minute I do, the minute I figure it out, I'm going to have new Rob's Random Roms to add in. So it'll be fun. Speaking of fun, which this has been, I wish to thank you for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, share. Uh, hit me up on Twitter, at Rob's Random Roms. Uh, go ahead and follow me on Twitch, twitch.tv slash sdmfcoroner. Um, I might be on there today. I don't know yet. Uh, I still have to, you know, get through a few things. And uh, I will see you all next time.